Oh boy, all right. So I just finished the 10th day of teaching myself linear algebra, just using ChatGPT, no prior experience with linear algebra before. And there are a couple things I wanna share from today that were interesting. One, I got through the ChatGPT lesson pretty quickly. Now someone asked me for the prompt that I used to set up the curriculum at first. I used ChatGPT Deep Research and basically, I'll sum it up, I said, I am good at math, I wanna move really fast, I wanna do this at an MIT upper Ivy League level, and I haven't taken a math class in a while, so you might need to refresh me on a couple things. But I want it to be pr based on problem solving, I want quizzes and tests as frequently as possible to make sure I actually understand the material, and I really want you to provide examples as we go because it's much easier for me to understand concepts with examples. I also said that this should lean a little bit more towards problem solving, uh, computation as opposed to theoretical proofs and things. I just thought that would be a better place to start from. And it's been really good so far, but I felt like today was a little easy. I was haunted by a comment someone left me on my YouTube channel saying, what was it exactly? <laughs> linear out, ChatGPT can't even solve my linear algebra homework. And I went, oh God, well, maybe I'm just using ChatGPT in a really effective way right now, but also it's very possible that I'm not seeing some of the hardest problems. So I therefore ended the lesson by going to Grok and saying, hey, what are some challenge problems that it would be in an advanced MIT class for this? And it gave me some really hard problems. We went from three by three matrices to four by four matrices, lots of edge case scenarios. And that was good. It was both eye-opening and in a positive way and in a slightly frightening way that I need to keep pushing myself here, keep challenging the models to make sure that I don't get complacent with the basic things they give me. And overall, it's been a really positive journey. So keep staying tuned. I appreciate everyone who's tunes into the live streams or watches these videos and stay learning.